Alert's over. Let's get back to work. drive. They're coming right at us. Any ideas, boss? Activity nearby. Bowman, we're entering a province called Espiritu Santo. Espiritu Santo is the base for Sueño's religious propaganda. Key to that is a woman named La Santera, a self proclaimed Santa Muerta priestess with thousands of loyal followers. That witch has an uncanny ability to turn men with guns into fanatics. 
That's the shit that keeps me up at night. Narcos have been into Santa Muerte for decades, but most worshippers aren't cartel. That's a small mercy. You got an angle on changing the mind of a fanatic? You're gonna need to dig for intel. Find out how to take down La Santera in a way that will demoralize the Sicarios and turn the regular folk away from the cartel. When she loses her congregation, bring that witch to me. Bowman out. <laughs> La Sentera, the saint maker, is una chica loca. This chick is batshit crazy. She used to be a good girl, devout Catholic, until she found Santa Muerte, the skinny lady, and went all in. El Cardinal is the light, charitable side of Santa Muerte. La Sentera is the dark hedonism. The cartel's twisted, fucked up version of the saint. El Sueño knows a chart topper when he sees one, so he put her on his label. Preach, mommy. What's good for Santa Muerte is good for Santa Blanca. He even built her a sanctuary deep in the heart of Espiritu Santo. La Santera's role in the cartel? Ensure loyalty. The more cartel members prove themselves, the more access they get to Santa Muerte. You want Santa Muerte to protect you from bullets? Smuggle 200 kilos. You want to be blessed with eternal wealth? Recruit five of your cousins to Santa Blanca. You want to go to heaven? Kill ten of her enemies. It's like a ranking system for scumbags. The more you do for your cartel, the more the saint of holy death will do for you. A true reward for true believers. And trust me on this. La Santera is a true believer. We got a Sicario. Right about that stack of tires. Yes, I it's pretty close, sir.
two turns. Váyase de aquí. Yo fuera tan ojo ya me habría suicidado, hijo de puta. This province is part of the cartel's influence operation, their propaganda machine. We should familiarize ourselves with their... Ramon. The man at the top is El Cardinal, an excommunicated priest turns it. where it's a proponent. He's also... Supposed to be the spiritual advisor to L. Swing... The guy in the mix is Ramon Feliz. He used to be a legit journalist till he inexplicably started blogging for the cartel. All priests like to hear themselves talk, don't they? But as the saying goes, talk is cheap. El Cardenal knew this was true. His people were barely surviving and he wanted to do something. He had to help those in need. He didn't care where the support came from. But there were others who thought he was making deals with the devil. He was cast out. He lost his family, his friends. Lo perdió todo. When I found him, he was a broken man. I brought him into Santa Blanca to preach the truth of the new faith. For we are wed to death from the moment we are born. And we must come to love her more than we love our lives. Sacred and blessed death, the goddess of darkness can free you from sickness and evil. Do you offer your heart and soul over to her? He baptized me in the true faith. He is my counselor, my conscience. I do. The only person I truly trust with my soul. Fuera de aquí. 